person in my closet. I've got a person in my closet. I've got a person in my closet. <laughs> Too weak to handle myself out there, huh, mother? Well, <laughs> tell that to my friend. This is all my fault. She was right. I never should have done this. I'm so sorry, Flynn. <laughs> Eugene. What? My real name is Eugene Fitzherbert. Someone might as well know. <laughs> I have magic hair that glows when I sing. What? I have... Magic hair that glows when I sing! Flower gleam and glow, let your power shine. <gasps> you here, Flynn Rider. Call it what you will. Fate, destiny. A horse. So I have made the decision to trust you. A horrible decision, really. But trust me when I tell you this. <laughs> you can tear this tower apart brick by brick, but without my help, you will never find your precious satchel. <clears throat> Let me just get this straight. I take you to see the lanterns, bring you back home, and you'll give me back my satchel? I promise. And when I promise something, I never, ever break that promise. Ever. All right, listen, I didn't want to have to do this, but you leave me no choice. Here comes the smolder. This is kind of an off day for me. This doesn't normally happen. Fine, I'll take you to see the lanterns. Really? Oops. You broke my smolder. You've got to be kidding me. Look, today is kind of the biggest day of my life. And the thing is, I need you not to get him arrested. Just for 24 hours, and then you can chase each other to your heart's content, okay? And it's also my birthday, just so you know.
No. No. Snugly duckling. Don't worry, very quaint place. Perfect for you. Don't want you scaring and giving up on this whole endeavor now, do we? Well, I do like duckling. Yay! Garçon, your finest table, please. <laughs> you smell that? Take a deep breath through the nose. <laughs> really let that seep in. <laughs> What are you getting? Because to me, it's part man smell, and the other part is really bad man smell. I don't know why, but overall, it just smells like the color brown. Your thoughts? That's a lot of hair. She's growing it out. Is it blood in your mustache? Goldie, look at this. Look at all the blood in his mustache. Good sir, that's a lot of blood. Hey, you don't look so good, Blondie. Maybe we should get you home, call it a day. Probably better off. This is a five-star joint, after all, and if you can't handle this place, well, maybe you should be back in your tower. Is this you? Every single day without fail. It looks absolutely exhausting, darling. Oh, it's nothing. Then I don't know why it takes so long. <laughs> oh, darling, I'm just teasing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, Mother, as you know, tomorrow is a very Rapunzel, big day. Look in that mirror. You know what I see? I see a strong, confident, beautiful young lady. <laughs> oh, look, you're here too. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Stop taking everything so seriously. <sighs> I could get used to a view like this. Yep. I'm used to it. Guys, I want a castle. Ah, the kingdom. It is beautiful. Clapping, dancing, general merrymaking. Not a care in the world. At least for most folks. See that handsome fellow running for his life? That is me. They just can't get my nose right. And that tower? Well, in that tower, there lived a girl who was just waiting for her life to begin. We really hit it off. How you doing? Gentleman that I am, I decided to help her. I'm prepared to offer you a deal. She could not resist me. I didn't want to have to do this, but you leave me no choice. Here comes the smolder. You coming, Blondie? And before we knew it, we began to uncover some secrets. I have to know what they are. I mean, this is serious stuff that just might turn this kingdom upside down. Flynn? Fire! Run! Head down. Head down. Arms in. Arms in. Knees apart. Knees apart. Knees apart. Something brought you here. Fate, destiny. A horse. Got home. Your finest table, please. Ah! Who's that? You don't like me. Who's that? Uh, let's just assume for the moment that everyone in here doesn't like me. Look out! This is kind of an off day for me. This doesn't normally happen. Go. Live your dream. I will. Your dream stinks. I was talking to her.